Blue Man Group is in Evansville for two performances only. The first one is this evening and you can still get tickets. The show is best known for multimedia performances which feature three bald and blue characters. Emily Muir live at Sunrise with more. Good morning, Emily. Aaron, good morning. We're here at the center in downtown Evansville. This is where those performances will take place. They're tonight and tomorrow, both starting at 730 and you can still get tickets uh, right here with me is one of the blue men <laughs> and tell me. I mean, we said that you were blue and bald, but you're not. Mm -hmm. um, you know, tell us kind of uh, what it takes to get prepared for this show. Um, well, uh, wow, what it takes to get prepared. <laughs> um, you know, it, the show is just a mix of multimedia, comedy, music, live art. Um, it, I like to think of it as a social science experiment that the Blue Men take the audience on. And so what it takes prepare, you know, for people to pre get prepared to do the show is just, you know, come in with no expectations, allow yourself to live in the moment and just enjoy what's going to unfold for that night. And what's uh, some of the favorite, you know, things you, you get to meet and greet with the people afterwards? What are people talking about? Um, I think the biggest thing that surprises everyone is the audience participation that happens in the show. There's so much in the show that hinges on where the audience is that night, you know, mentally and physically. And so it's really nice to be able to, to craft a show just for that specific audience each night. And uh, people in the front rows get to wear ponchos because it mm -hmm. gets a little messy. Talk a little bit about the paint and stuff that's used. Uh, yeah, there's definitely a poncho section, um, although it's not our goal to get people you know sloshed with paint or, or anything like that but there you know there is a messy element to it but um but yeah it's just one of these shows that's it's sort of really unlike anything else and so people just need to come out and just experience it and uh do you recommend people to bring their children is it family friendly oh absolutely there's something for everybody and especially with the new finale that we have in our show and i don't want to give too much away it's always fun to see you know a grandmother with their grandchildren up on their feet dancing and just enjoying the show with each other all right, thanks so much, Pierre, for joining us this morning. We're going to talk to him again uh, coming up later in the show, but you can get tickets uh, right here starting at 10 a.m. and also on Ticketmaster.com. Again, those shows are tonight and tomorrow here at the center at 7.30. Back to you. Well, hopefully a lot of people take advantage of that and head out there today. Well, excited crowds camped out.